today on an all-new Dr. Phil. Body language expert specializing in human behavior and facial recognition, Susan Constantine. Jury consultant, Susan Constantine. Jury consultant and body language expert, Susan Constantine, joins me now. Susan Constantine is a body language expert. Susan Constantine has trained police in picking up on involuntary movements. Got jury consultant and body language expert, Sue Constantine. My opinion is thereby limited the context of the 38 minutes of the video that I have watched of the Hebrew video with English subtitles. In the light of the foregoing, it is my professional opinion that Nathan was not being deceptive and was truthful in recounting his experience to his visitation in heaven. In short, I do not believe that Nathan was making the story up. I was also added, uh, would like to add that dur during the certain details that Nathan recounts are less certain, as he was also uh, questioned by the rabbi for additional details. And the nature of the questions interrupted the free flow of Nathan's recounting of the story. Thus, I cannot state that all of Nathan's story was his own experience or whether the questions posed by the rabbi tainted the recounting of his experience. As an example, Nathan starts out speaking from first person using I, and then switches to third person you. When queried by the rabbi a few times in the story, it appeared that he was seeking the rabbi's approval when Nathan looked at the rabbi when asking him questions and when asking for permission to continue. However, it remains my opinion that Nathan does in fact believe that he experienced a visitation in heaven and was not being deceptive in making this assertion. Other details recounting by Nathan are difficult to gauge from a truthful perspective due to the frequent queries by the rabbi. This is my statement and again my name is Susan Constantine and I am a behavioral analysis expert specializing in deception detection. Thank you so much and have a great day.